Hey everybody, Chris from Samuri here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to get started with Recon Lab, and more importantly, how to get it installed. So, stay tuned. And today I wanted to give you guys a quick tutorial on how you're supposed to get started with Recon Lab and how you're supposed to get it installed. Now, before you get to installing Recon Lab, there are four prerequisites that you have to make sure are covered. Uh, the first of which is making sure that Xcode is installed. So Xcode contains many powerful uh, libraries and commands that Recon Lab utilizes in order to make our Mac side much more powerful than any other tool. So the easiest way to install this is to just uh, open up an, an instance of the App Store and then search Xcode developer tools. And the first one that should pop up will be this little hammer behind a blueprint of the Apple logo or the, uh, the App Store logo. And you can just go ahead and click this one uh, and yours will say install. Uh, mine's already been installed just to save time. So you're just gonna go ahead and hit get and it will automatically install it on the background and then you're good to go and as far as Xcode is concerned. The next thing that you need to make sure that you have installed is Fuse. Now Fuse allows for the mounting of many different uh, file systems and kind of acts as an interpreter for things that are non-native to Mac OS. So uh, the links to all of these will be down in the description below, by the way, just wanted to throw that out there. But basically all you would have to do for this one is just find the latest release of Fuse. You would download this installer and then you just run it and you'd be good to go. Uh, the next one that you guys need to worry about is Paragon. Now, uh, Samuri is partnered with Paragon, and we actually provide a free key code of their Mac toolbox and their uh, Linux interpreter for Mac OS. So, all you'd have to do is navigate to Paragon's website, and you'd have to create an account with them, uh, but it's, uh, it's a simple two-step process. Just input a username and password and you have an account. And then you'd all just have to go down to register a new product and input the Paragon key code that we give you. Your Paragon key code should be in a PDF format on your Recon Lab USB when you first get it. And basically you just copy that out, put that in here and you'd hit register and it would automatically give you uh, EXTFS for Mac, uh, which helps with Linux and then uh, the Mac toolbox. So the big one that you have to worry about is uh, XFS for Mac. Uh, you can just go ahead and download that. It'll give you an installer and uh, you know just follow the steps that are prompted and you'll, you'll be good to go. And uh, the Mac toolbox, you don't have to install it, but then again, we include it for free, so why not? It just helps to expand your, your toolbox and you know make sure that you have more bases covered. And the final thing that you have to do is install Python. Now, uh, you can install Python by the, just navigating to python.org and then going to the downloads. Uh, but there are some other things that need to be covered, which uh, if you look at section 8.2 of our Recon Lab manual, those cover how to, how to get Python installed because there are some other steps that uh, would take a little bit too much time to explain. Now, now that you have all of those installed, you can actually get started with uh, installing Recon Lab itself. So when you get your USB, inside your USB is a DMG containing the latest version of Recon Lab. Now all you would have to do is double click your DMG and uh, it'll open and inside will be the Recon Lab installer. Now it's just mounting the file system real quick and inside is the Recon Lab installer. Like I said, you're just gonna go ahead and double click on that. And it's going to give you a window that asks you if you want to open this app because it's been downloaded from the internet, in which case you're going to hit open. And you'll be presented with three options, uh, two of which you need to worry about. The other one would just be if you're trying to uninstall Recon Lab. Uh, you'll have install and clean install. So install will be for users who already have an instance of Recon Lab on their machine and want to update to a newer version. And on, or clean install would be for uh, like a first time install or if you're trying to remove any previous instances that you have. So in our case, since this is the first time we're installing it, we're gonna select clean install. It'll just run a short little program to install Recon Lab on your machine. And once it's done, uh, you'll get this little message down on the bottom left that'll say done. And you just have to open your applications or in our, in our case, we already have it. Uh, we have a shortcut that's put on the dock. So just go ahead and open that. And it'll prompt us to choose our license file. Uh, our license file is stored on our Recon Lab USB. In my case, I've named it Chris's Recon Lab, so it's easier to see. 
and it'll be a long string of numbers, which will be the serial number of your drive and your name. So you just select that and select the license file inside. And it'll load Recon Lab. It'll take a couple seconds just because it's the first time we've run it on this machine. And you'll have to type in the admin password for your system. And hit OK. And there we go. Recon Lab's installed. And you get a little message that explains some information about it. But now yeah. Recon Lab's finished installing, so now you're ready to go. Um, Thank you everybody for watching. Uh, make sure to check out our other videos that we have posted. We've got uh, some sequential processing videos and one that's talking about how to get uh, updates for your Recon ITR drive. So thanks everybody for watching and have a great day and stay safe.